Hi there, this is Hong Forrest, independent distributor with It Works Global, and I'm showing you how to wrap your tummy today. So there's a couple things that you will need, so grab your wrapping supplies and follow along. So this is just a glimpse of the supplies to have on hand when you are wrapping. You have plastic wrap to hold your wrap in place, or you can use our newer fab wrap, and it's this breathable material kind of like pre-wrap if you've ever been taped for athletic purposes or whatnot, but it's this breathable material that you can use instead of plastic wrap. Also, um, I have a Velcro support band that I had purchased before I had both of my children, so that comes in handy now if you want to use that to hold it in place. Other things to have on hand, your phone so that you can take before and after pictures, of course, and if you are measuring, have a tape measure so that you can measure. Obviously, you'll need scissors to open up the wrap itself, and you'll need the wraps itself. So that's all that you need. Water is always a great thing to have on hand when you are wrapping, of course, and just for regular hydration purposes. But this is a look at just what you need in order to prepare to wrap. I'm going to get myself ready to wrap and everything. So I'm wrapping my tummy today, so I'm going to lift my shirt up to about bra line areas, well, only as far as you need to go up. And then I always like to wrap really low on tummies especially if you've had kids and everything. So I'm gonna pull my pants down a little bit lower. And then what you do is you take one of the wraps out of the box of four. They come in a box of four. You take a wrap out. Um, you cut it open with scissors. So cut the top open with scissors. You pull your wrap out and you start to unfold it all the way. Once you've unfolded it all the way, you'll notice that there's already cream on it on the one side. And what you do is line up that middle button or the middle line with your belly button and apply it to your skin just like this. I have a pretty short torso, so what I'm going to do is slide mine down a little bit further. Wrap the wrap around myself. And then the bottom portion, you can tuck that down um, into the skin that's on the lower portion of your abdomen. So I get this on like this, and then you have a couple of options for holding it in place. You can use a tight-fitting shirt like this green tank top that I have on. That can keep the wrap in place. Um, as long as it's not sliding around, it does its purpose. You can use plastic wrap, which most everybody has in their household. Plastic wrap works awesome. Two layers around to hold it into place, and I'm going to do that to show you just because it's such a common object that people have um, in their homes. So you just start the plastic wrap on one side and bring the roll around to the other side. And just two layers. It doesn't have to be super tight or anything. This isn't about compression or anything. This is just about keeping the wrap itself into place so it's not moving around. So I've got two layers on, and then I'm just gonna rip it off like that, and that's it. So if you were using the fab wrap, you could, instead of the plastic wrap, you would just use the fab wrap and wrap it around. Um, in place of the plastic wrap, or like I normally do, I use this Velcro belly support band and I put it around, no plastic wrap, I just put it around the wrap itself and like this and I hold it into place. And then I kick back and relax for 45 minutes, um, you know, read a book, watch a show, hang out with the family, whatever, but it's important to have your water, of course, so make sure you're drinking your water and 45 minutes after you wrap, you unwrap, you take your pictures, and that's it. Well, I will have the wrap on for about 45 minutes. If it's your first time, definitely only keep it on for the 45 minutes, and then you can remove it afterwards. If you've worn the wrap before, you could keep it up on up to 8 hours, but there's no need to keep it on that long. Some people just like how it feels. So after the 45 minutes, you'll want to take the wrap off rub in any extra cream, and then take your after pictures and any measurements if you are doing them. And in three days, take another series of photos so that you can compare how the product is with your before photo and your three-day photo. Because remember, the product keeps working on your body and in your system for the following three days. So make sure you're drinking plenty of water, avoiding the vices such as alcohol, caffeine, and the foods that are not necessarily healthy for you. So avoid those things over the next three days to really maximize your results. So if you have questions, contact the distributor who shared this with you. And happy wrapping.